Okay, return to a job I put in about three years ago. Um, Beastman 200, as you'd expect from me. And um, this was quite an interesting job, a little bit complicated. It was a um, poor installation, poor temperature control. Um, customer was complaining floors not heating up and some heating up. So we had to rectify it all and the, the boiler had failed, so a heat exchanger had failed on it. I think it's three years old. Um, can't remember what boiler it was. But um, anyway, um, this is something I started doing now on all my installations. I'm putting the, the hose in and leaving it in um, so it's all connected. So when you come to service, uh, basically you've just got the hose ready to stick into the nearest drain point, which might be the tun dish in this case, um, and can drain down quickly. I haven't got to hunt around for the right length hose or a piece of hose that fits. They're already there fitted. Um, Anyway, this job um, has got radiators and a few underfloor heating circuits. So here you can see we've got hot water priority to the cylinder. Uh, that's plumbed in down there. And again, I've got these uh, European standard drain cocks um, on the system. They're much easier to drain down. And so we're coming along. This one's got plate separation on it. And um, so, uh, a little bit complicated to follow because I had to try and connect in with all the system but uh, let me try for you so we've got the, the flow in from the boiler on the back side of the plate heat exchangers and the return from the boiler on the lower side and we have got the flow out um, to our systems this one's going up into a standard fixed temperature blending valve and this does the underfloor heating in the bathrooms upstairs. So this is fixed at a relatively high temperature. Um, and um, we'll basically warm those floors up. Those floors are toasty. Right, then the other option is it goes off down here. It goes past another mixing valve. So you see the T here. Uh, it's a hot feed into this mixing valve. And also it's directly pumped here off around the radiator circuit. And here we have the Wiesmann mixer to the ground downstairs underfloor heating. So this is all um, weather comp controlled and uh, of course the usual thing is that they've got the report from the customer, total comfort, uh, regular temperatures in all the rooms, uh, very very happy uh, whereas they weren't before when they had the manifold pump and fixed temperature equipment and boiler running at high temperature. Um, so just to recap, one mixed circuit for ground floor, underfloor heating and then constant pumped, constant temperature circuit for the radiator circuit. Up there's bathrooms, underfloor system. We've got um, a kind of temperature limit I guess from, from that valve. And this is all through plate separation.